six. Level six is when it becomes round two rounds. Oh, the chance for proking? You're kidding me. It has to be nine. I don't even want to invest this much. I, I'm, I'm not sure if I can. I, I'm not sure if I can invest on, especially when the characters is not. There's no good shotguns unless it will completely change sugar. There's no overloads in shooting range. God, I wish they could. You can do that uh, shooting range. You could do it with the over, overload, but yeah. All right, well, I'm going to compare probably Sugar and Scarlet. We might not even get the max stacks because we need the cube. Okay, let's see. Oh my God, look at that speed. Look at that speed. It's like... A <laughs> Yo, that's not bad. I'm not going to burst with Scarlet. But wait, we're we're stuck at two stacks. Oh man, that's the ooh. It, look, you, you're seeing it. You can see it also. The 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 buff, the stacks is showing on sugar also. It sh is showing. Oh, right there, three stacks. It the, I do feel a little bit of difference. You're seeing the difference when it's three stacks. But then she just dropped it again. You just drop it just now and then again we bursted without full we bursted without this we bursted without full stacks because because she kept dropping the stacks so we bursted again without full stacks so that the yo we only got one stack of me uh miracle makeshifting that means i have to keep waiting until she gets max stacks before I start initiate my burst. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not gonna burst. I'm waiting for the max stacks. Okay, max stacks. Right there. And then now you you Yeah, there's three stacks, is there? Yeah, there's three it shows three stacks here. It shows three stacks of attack 24%. I'll say at least. Um not having the over the cooldown. It's not the absolute worst scenario. I'll say at that at least. Oh my god, dropping my stacks though. Okay, I killed I killed the two that's close by. Which is basically Sugar's advantage. And then now like Sugar is obviously I'm ahead of Scarlet. We didn't burst with Scarlet. We bursted with Sugar. Not bursting with Scarlet because of the AoE and that's gonna damage Pred Scarlet. So we bursted with Sugar and Noir. But see now let's look at, now that the enemy what if we look at look at this though. Look at Sugar's hit rate. Rip Sugar's hit rate. Yeah, so like Scarlet is catching up now because of this. Oh the zero stack burst oh my bad i wasn't paying attention yeah see now you have to pay attention that you have to make sure that you have stacks this is this is this is an issue right now you have to pay attention that you make sure you have stacks you can't just burst like the moment it's available yeah I, dude i can't burst right now i don't have stacks i have like zero stacks i can't so i don't want to burst right now and it's keep dropping it's not even getting three right there it's three now so it's like it's putting you in like a really bad situation because like oh do you, you do you want the buff for your sh your your shotgun right does the crit damage even stack It'd be hilarious if it's not it didn't it did not are you kidding me so only the max ammo is stacking the crit damage is why 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 did you bother putting crit on her stats it's like you're insulting all other crit units the max ammo stacks but not the critical da why even put it there just don't like i i think my mind would have been saner if it if it didn't have crit you know just go with the tax fee just go with the ammo i would totally understand it but why did you put crit so we keep dropping stacks let's put resilience in 
Okay. Oh no, if I want to put resilience, I have to give it levels because, uh... Oh, I can't put resilience in. Because I have that, that means I have to re I have to increase the level of the skill one and I'm not really willing to level up my skill one. It's so expensive, dude. It All right. Um, so I, I leveled it 644. This is the probably the most I'm willing to just for testing purposes. And it will also also kind of give us like a good idea. Um, you know, if she is worth any further investment. Yeah, yeah. Actually, chat, it's not super bad with resilience in it. Look. Oh, well, she dropped it just now. <laughs> As I was saying something, <laughs> she just she just dropped it. Um <laughs> like I was saying, I mean it Oh well she dropped it. Every time she reloads, she drops it. If I don't, who else will? Oh. oh my skill books <gasps> hey 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 i better see those likes and comments and subscribes on the youtube video we're gonna make okay fucking where's this I, I better see those subscriptions all right let's see the stacks let's see let's see it is she ever gonna drop the stacks? She reloaded? She dropped the stacks, but, but, wait. She got the stacks again. She's full. Wait. It's full again. She he got full before she bursted. Hold up. Keep shooting. Keep shooting. She's gonna, she's gonna, oh, she dropped the stacks, but, but wait. Oh my god, it's full again! What? What? It got full before she burst. We bursted! Oh my god, it's full! The 1%! It's skill 1, level 9. No, like, there's, there's literally. No, don't. There's no compromise. It has to be skill 9 skill issue lock do it again three minutes three minute run you have to level nine it there's no excuses oh oh no she dropped the stacks she dropped the stacks oh my brick <laughs> chat relax oh my god chill no, she dropped the stacks again. Wait, no, no, no. We're getting, we're getting back. We're getting back. No, it's one stack. Dang it. Oh, she bursted at one stacks. I mean, to be fair, you could have waited a little bit, like probably a couple seconds because we got it back up pretty fast. No, we bursted at zero stacks. If you reload at the wrong time. So like it's, it's really the reload time that kind of screws it over because it's usually it's during when she's reloading. Yeah, so maybe either Bastion, I could see a Bastion working out yeah, if we can do unlimited ammo. So if you have max ammo capacity with Bastion, I could see that. Yeah, you definitely probably would want ammo so that like you're there's really low like lower gap of or lower chance of you dropping it for sure. You definitely want as many max ammo as possible so that because the the reload is when i really drop it with uh not so before between the reload yeah see that's 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 when i drop the stacks but then if i don't reload it, it feels like she can keep the stacks consistently so if we're gonna have to choose about like the overload for her definitely um max ammo i definitely want max ammo Bastion better also because she has reload on skill one. Okay, however, let me see real quick. Okay, so let's let, let's look at this. So 500, that's with her. Let us, how about if we try with litter? 
the five second buff from litter now obviously litter also has the cooldown reduction right Be by doing that we can you can you can change dollar you can replace dollar with like a better burst that that would actually complement it but let's assu the, assuming that we're just like you know we're using the same thing yes and litter is maxed also so if we get like a really good burst too that has a cooldown reduction yeah and the skill too and burst also this actually might cook up something it might replace the 2b and a2 team 5 that we have been using yeah because you have to realize the team 5 is using dala you have to realize the team 5 is using dala and usually you're stuck with like jackal because okay you have the team 4 with miranda right and snow white volume with like you know some other like you know tia naga or um bunnies litter with tia naga or bunnies and then dorothy with brevity so your team five right now is like you know sakura noise or pepper or jackal so you're not because you we do lack a good buffer because like the last buffer is like n102 she will make shotgun better depending on the boss this would this might actually be really good the damage difference is insane we did 500 mil twice by the way right we did 500 mil twice so let me try this again with litter again 450 we didn't reach 500 at all meanwhile tove reached 500 mil with the two attempts jesus look at that damage though she does ramp up so much when she's bursting kind of nice though it does synergize a lot because like sugar does get a lot of max ammo and you have to keep in mind that was a 944 i'm not fully invested yet on my tove she could be giving more buffs attack speed and buff so the thing is this team doesn't have any fast charging unit so it's not really able to take advantage of litter's cooldown reduction fast charge if we have a fast charge it would be nicer because like when the enemy is far shotgun's energy gain is kind of worse so this team kind of isn't as efficient as i would like about the same damage so this one is actually weaker looking at it this yeah this litter team actually was weaker because the previous one was 671 and 653 yeah, because I literally got worse damage than as if it just I just used Tove. Because you probably don't need Dala, for example, if you can put in another DPS shotgun. That is something to consider, actually. Alright, this is the shotgun team that we talked about um, on the pre-analysis. Let's see. I think Bastion... You know what? I am actually more inclined with Bastion. And the main reason why that is the case, because this skill one regens her ammo, right? Every time it procs, it reloads a percentage of her magazine. I feel like if you all though for max ammo, her Earth one would lead some interesting interplay with Bastion. I have a feeling that too. I was thinking like she would have unlimited ammo, essentially. The fight and sim to simulate Dove with Bastion at different ammo capacity to see how many shots she'd get per clip on average. Dove skill 1, level 9, Bastion level 7, simulation runs. The more max ammo you have, the scaling is insane. So with 60 clip, you have 105 predicted shots. With 102, you have 295. With 180, though this is like 160. Uh, this is 100 percent. This is 200 percent, and you have 713. What with 200 percent ammo? That is a lot. Yeah. So if you get four tier 11 max ammo, 2,000 predicted shots per clip. So basically, yeah, you definitely really want that ammo. You almost would not 
reload at that point. 2160 shots would be 3 minutes of constant shooting. So yes, at around 4 tier 11 max ammo lines, she would basically wouldn't reload. Uh, so we'll burst with Sugar and Drake and then like Guilty. So like this is kind of like the damage that we're expecting, right? With these characters. Um, so Scarlet will act kind of like Guilty. And I want to see how much difference it is. Because, again, the standard uh, of our DPS is Scarlet. Core shots, to be fair. You have to realize core shots. Remember um, the damage distribution between Sugar and Scarlet? And then, like, against, like, when it, the enemy was close versus when the enemy was farther? So, that's just how it is. Because, again, because of the enemies, right? Like, when they're faster. To be fair, the shooting range is kind of bad for sh shotguns. Let's try this um, in special interception. So this is an example of like what I like what I was showing you, because the the boss works out better with sugar because all your shots are actually hitting the things. So like. Just because Sugar was dealing less damage on shooting range doesn't mean that she will deal less damage on the boss. So I actually think there is a position for this. Again, like it's it's more about just make getting the shotgun working out against the boss. But then if they work out against the boss, I think if I min-max my Sugar a bit more, because like right now, my Scarlet has an ideal line. Let me show you my Scarlet lines. I have a max ammo on one, and then I have a max ammo here also, and then elemental and max ammo. But then this one is kind of low world max ammo. And then the last one is elemental damage. Okay, so I have like three, essentially two lines of max ammo, and then one line, one or a half line of a max ammo. So two and a half lines of max ammo. And then my sugar has one line of attack, one line of max ammo. That's the main thing that is kind of the difference. And then if we put it against like a boss, right? This is kind of how they would perform. Summer Mary with 2B um, and Scarlet. This is kind of how they would perform against the boss. And A2 with parts, she's dealing with the parts. Uh, like a full invested 2B and like a, these, like a core 2. This is a 2B core 7 and this is Scarlet core 2. So what we're seeing here, however, though, you got to keep in mind, my Dove is still not fully maxed yet. So if we overload her and we increase this level skill to and burst skill, I actually think she might actually make like a difference for shotgun. And if the shotgun actually fit the solo raid boss, this would actually make the shotgun a viable team because what i would end up doing is i would do this right like more in with more investment on tove i would do this and let, let's try this let's try this team actually too the attack speed will make a lot of difference wait that was faster uh, you know what i forgot uh guilty has elemental advantage yep that's why but wait I don't think I have elemental buff on my guilty. So I'm only getting 10%, well, no, actually 20% more damage because of the cube also. My guilty has two ammo, one, uh, two lines of attack and two lines of attack. Yeah, a 20% attack with 110% uh, ammo. Well, there you go. Shotgun team actually might be pretty valuable. It's gonna be boss defendant but we're actually gonna see something shotgun seems better than doobie team only if the boss works out because again this is my solo raid this is my solo raid damage i was using summer mary with a2 and 2b so uh and summer mary um i believe she yeah she will buff 2b right 2b's damage because summer mary increases the hp when you're bursting right so uh, she does buff 2b's damage a little bit because of that and it is a little bit safer with the healer yeah so she so there's a little bit buff and then like it, it it provides like good healing right i could see this as an alternative theme five and 
again, it's primarily because like Team 5 doesn't have any other good buffers. And in the future where there might be better shotguns, she is definitely gonna be really good. Like if there's other better, better future shotguns. And yeah, obviously if I invest more on it, they uh, she would deal more damage. But skill one has to be level nine. There's like, there's just almost like zero reason to to not do that level nine. That that is too much of like a nerf. If you're doing it four percent versus five percent, let's look. Let's talk about the teams, cause like, I feel like we. I mean, to be fair, I kind of talked about it before, right? The the main team that where she really is at right now, and especially as a team five, is basically with Dala and you have Guilty. I think this is probably the best shotgun team right now. We could try with Isabel. And it's a lot more front loaded into sugar's damage and again are you also willing to <laughs> overload um isabel that's another question for me i'm gonna be using drake because one of the bigger reason is this team doesn't have a lot of attack buff sugar doesn't have her self attack buff and so she will benefit with more attack buffs and you know, Dala does give attack buff and Tove does too, but you know, she doesn't have self attack buff like Scarlet. So she is going to get way more damage with more attack buff. Uh, other alternative team. Let me think about this because like really, there's really no other shotguns. It's a, yeah, if you put another dps just a, a just an extra dps not necessarily okay you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put maiden okay just a, mo a little bit more dps bully might be cooking something that could work out naga right but then you are kind of stuck without having cooldown which is kind of like a shame for naga team and also like core shots you have to realize that Naga does benefit on core shots. And so it's very counterintuitive to what shotguns are. So Enor, she's definitely stuck with Blanc. The question is, do you want to use Blanc and Nor together? That's going to be a trade-off. I think from boss to boss, you're just going to have to debate between that. Yeah, I would probably do something like this and then just put another DPS. And I'll probably eat the lack of cooldown if you're going for like a good dps of shotguns right where basically noir and guilty will d and sugar will do the heavy carrying because of the shotgun nature i think this one would be not a bad team overall thoughts on this there is potential if you're ready to build your shotgun team i could see that if you're coping for future shotgun I could see that as well but also you have to understand that shotgun is not gonna be a team that will be used in any boss there's gotta be specific bosses because again like i like i showed earlier too in this one like if the boss is far away and then your shot reticle is not gonna cover the entire boss you could miss those bullets and that, it, that, that's huge dps loss but then like, you know, I switched when we did Modernia, all a lot of their hits end up hitting, you know, she was actually, Sugar was actually catching up with Scarlet too. Even though Scarlet wasn't really being buffed there heavily, to be fair, Scarlet is one of the units that can stand alone without like their own buffers. And anything else that would essentially indirectly buff Scarlet would also indirectly buff like sugar the same way you know with novel for example uh or like volume and mass something like that like crit base to a certain degree scarlet being buffed by those other teams will also buff sugar would i recommend it to pull uh if you want to start building a shotgun team you just need to be aware of the downsides pros and cons of shotgun um if you want to cope for 
picture other good shotguns i think one copy is not bad i might get mlb depending on how this full session luck goes if i'm lucky then maybe i'll push but if i'm not lucky i have a lot of tickets i can wait you know what i'm just gonna wait <laughs> I have 825 tickets. I'll just wait. She's gonna be in the wish list, right? In the miss yeah. And also my missiles. <laughs> I need more units. Everyone else is max score except Tia and Naga. Yeah, I have. I'm good. I I'll wait until she becomes available in the wish list. I'm good. Not limited. Yeah, I'll I'll wait. And people that is starving on gems, I think you can you can skip. I think you can skip and then just like wishlist her because again like shotgun is a very limited team that's kind of how i see it like they, they have a lot of restrictions and the team is kind of limited right now and right now i'm i can entertain it because i have a lot of teams that are i've already built like my my teams are very like built now that i don't need kind of i i can start exploring team 4 team 5 a lot more but for a lot of people uh they're probably still fixing their team 2 some are still fixing their team 1 because they're new players so some are fixing their team 2 so i think it's a wishlist character i think it's a it's a lot of wishlist character but um i could see a lot of competitive people just get one copy for like flexibility thing i i'm seeing it more for like top 50 top 200 people but if you're not top 200 uh, yeah, if you're not aiming for like top 200 in solar raid you, you'll you'll be fine with a lot of the meta teams right now i i don't think you're gonna miss out so i think it's uh it's a very top competitive 